Discover the cold hard facts about Fairfax County real estate this February. I'm Melvin Yates with the Flagship Group. On this month's edition of Your Real Estate Market Insight, we'll cover the current state of interest rates, how the availability of housing inventory affects home prices in this neighborhood, and the current time it takes to sell a home. We'll also provide your local neighborhood data to help you compare your neighborhood's value with others. Now don't forget to like and subscribe to stay updated on the latest real estate information for this community. And if you're planning to develop a real estate game plan in the next 18 months, you've come to the right place. Now for the numbers. The average sales price was $716,000. This is a 0.8% decrease over last year and a 0.9% decrease over last month. The total sales volume in Fairfax County, all added together, was $401 million. Now that's down 28% over the prior month. The average time it took to find a buyer was 35 days. In all of Fairfax County, there were 552 homes that ultimately sold. Now that's down 28% over the prior month and down 32% over last year this time. I want to assure you that the agents on the team have clients who are actively seeking to purchase homes in this neighborhood. If you're considering selling your home within the next 18 months, I encourage you to reach out so we can discuss a plan. Additionally, if you know anyone who may be interested in selling their home, please feel free to pass along our information. I recommend watching our next video, which will feature your local community data reports. Don't forget to like and subscribe before you leave and visit our website for a free home value estimate. You can also contact me via phone, text, or email at any time for a free market analysis of your home. Thank you for choosing us as your trusted source for local real estate information in DC, Maryland, and Virginia.